Hi, my name is Matthew Pierce. I'm a software engineer, and today I'm going to talk to you about NetBeans tutorials using Java. Now, NetBeans is a freely available uh, IDE or Integrated Development Environment, environment excuse me, that's available from NetBeans.org. To acquire it, go to this website right here, NetBeans.org, to their downloads page, and they have you know, many different types of uh, you know, downloads, different bundles. Um, if you're just going to be doing Java, and that's it, this is a good one, it's only 77 megs. But if you're going to be doing all sorts of stuff, well, this is the one to get. It's, uh, it could be the one to get. There's different variations within that, too. But this has got everything. And this is one that I download because I do many other things in Java. Um, and there's also, once you get it downloaded, there's other add-ons you can get to do other things like Ruby and, and whatnot. There's just a whole lot of stuff that's freely available for it. Now, once you get it downloaded and installed, you're going to want to create a project. To do that, I'll show you here. I've already created one project. I'll just do it again. I'm going to right click in here, say new project. Uh, I'll start with the Java project, Java application. Hit next, give it a name. I'll call it Hello2, because I've already got Hello World. And see right here, I've got it create main class. If you, if you check that, it'll create the main class for you so then you can just start filling in code. Hit finish. It builds it for you. There it is right there. And so this file right here, you can look in the Project Explorer. You can see where the project is and where its source files are. Here's the source file that I just created. This is the one that it automatically created with the main class. Um, and this is the main class. And is the traditional new language uh, program is to uh, write uh, hello world. I'll write system.out.println. Hello world. Actually, I don't have to do a slash in. And then run it. Look at the output. There it is. That's how you, that's how you set up NetBeans and you know, create a kind of an empty, very rudimentary project. So once you've got that up and going, you're going to want to learn how to program in Java. And there are so many uh, really good Java tutorials out there on the internet. And two of the best ones are from NetBeans.org, NetBeans.org, where you got NetBeans. The other one is from Oracle, who uh, are the, the maintainers of the Java, Java language. They're the ones who uh, you know, came from Sun, but Oracle owns Sun now. So you can go to their website right here to go to their tutorials, and they have tutorials for everything, you know, just getting started, to GUIs, all the way through uh, you know, Java Beans and you know, network programming, graphics, everything. It's just, a whole bunch of stuff in there that'll really get you going. And then you can also go to the, the netbeans.org uh, learning Java pages, and they have some online classes and tutorials here too. You can see you've got beginner, intermediate, some professional stuff. But there's just all sorts of stuff that's freely available out there, and it's official stuff, it's stuff that's really been sanctioned by you know, Oracle and the NetBeans people. So it's, it's, it's the definitive authoritative stuff to learn. My name is Matthew Pierce. Today we talked about NetBeans tutorials using Java. Thanks for watching.